The pregame festivities are over, and we're just about set to get this game underway. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. Coming to you, coming to you. Here's the gift. Gets to about the 27-yard line. Seven-yard line. Third down. Check back, 11, check back, Here we go. Here we go. Black five. Go. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. That was a really nice play on the ball by the receiver for a substantial gain and a first down. And they'll bring him down at the 46. Good job here by the receiver to look the ball in and ensure he had possession. That's the right way to catch a pass. Throws it in a hurry. Tackle made at the 27-yard line. The pass results in a first down. I'll tell you, great call by the coaches on first down. It stretches the defense when they're expecting the run, and then they end up with another first down. in and scoops up the fumble. They work hard and they got the turnover. Well, this is what it's all about. Defense taking advantage of an opportunity. They're pouncing on the loose ball. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. Play fake, looking to run. He's taken down at the 36-yard line. That makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Gains his way to the 49-yard line. tries to buy some time. He's at the 40. He gets hit out of bounds at about the 39-yard line. It's first and 10. Ball on the 39-yard line. Mike 20, Mike 20, Mike 20. Go! And two, green 15. Not a safe pass at all. Really tight coverage and not a lot of room. Credit the receiver with going after that one and hanging on. They'll spread the field with five wide. Touchdown, Gamecocks. And he tacks on the extra point. A nice five-play, 72-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well-executed touchdown drive. So our score, 7-0. South Carolina's looking right now like they've got all three phases working for them so far, Kirk. Yep, it's early, but they are in control of this game. The defense is, seems to have a very good feel for what they're doing out there. The hey, offense the moved the ball down the field. Special teams, everything right now is really in sync. 
And they got to him before he could get back to the line. By the time the running back here got the football, he's looking up. He's got a couple defensive linemen closing in on him because they were able to slip off of their blocks. Really, there's nothing he could do at all there. That was more of a miscommunication and just getting overmatched up front by the offensive line. From their own 24-yard line, second down. Quick throw. And he's tackled around the 34-yard line. What impresses me so much is the guy's vision. He read the coverage perfectly to find his man for good yardage. And they make the stop at the 42. Quick throw. He steps out at about the 47 yard line. Fires it out. And he's tackled in the open field. A quarterback's best friend is a receiver he can count on to catch the ball every time he drops back the pass. That's good. He's hit immediately. Slings it. That is a loss of five. That'll bring up third and six. And once again, they'll come to the line, try to convert on third down. Makes the catch and gets out of bounds. Good job by the offensive line to pick up the linebacker on the blitz. That gave the quarterback enough time to find his man for a nice game. Gets it. He's in space. He's pushed out of bounds at the 13. He scrambled. And down he goes at the nine yard line. Pulls it in and stopped in his tracks with that tackle. That's a gain of three on the play. Tight end right. That makes it third and three. Three down, three down. Red two. Green eight. Motion. They go to the screen here, and the halfback's got it. Knocked out of bounds at the five-yard line. The D sniffs out the screen pass and holds him to a short game. Contain, contain, contain. That's the only way you can shut down a guy with 4-2 speed. The kick is up, and it's through the uprights. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He just drills this one. goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The game time really got the job done on that first drive, and they took the crowd out of this thing. They sure did, and I was really impressed with the execution by the quarterback. It's tough to be able to communicate with your linemen and not to mention your wide receivers, but he did a very nice job of showing great poise, keeping his composure, and leading them to some points. We'll see what he can do here this next time out. South Carolina is up four. Tackle at about the 33-yard line. That's, That's good, good for a gain of eight yards. yards. That, that makes it so. It's second two. down and about two yards to go. <laughs> Let's go! Hey, 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 Mike Forty, Mike Forty. Two, two, twenty. 
He gets out to about the 35 yard line. Gaining two yards. That makes it first and ten. We're through one quarter. South Carolina is up by four. Back to the action here in the second quarter. It's been a good one and a tight one at this point. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. He's knocked out of bounds at the 48. I'm really liking what I see from this guy. He's not afraid to go to the air on any down. From the 48-yard line, it's first down. Black five, black five, X7. Watch the slant, watch the slant. He's tackled at the 39-yard line. Reception. Number two with the tackle at the 39-yard line. That brings up second and one. Here we go, here we go. Mike 40, Mike 40. Red two. And he's tackled right away. From the 28-yard line, first down. South Carolina holds a four-point lead. Scrambling around, brought down at the 20. Makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. They're not ready for this. They still playing soccer. Y'all playing the wrong football. He gets out to about the 18 yard line. And this play is number eight on the drive. Nice run up the middle. He decided to keep it himself this time on the option, and he managed to get upfield and pick up the first down. First and 10, ball on the 14. Red two! Boy, did you see how the defense just swarmed to the ball carrier? That was fantastic pursuit. Here's play number 10 on the drive. Let's go. Check back 40. Check back 40. And he just gets rid of it. And they'll look to convert here on another third down. most reliable receivers around. They needed a big play on third down, and he got it for them. And this is the 12th play of the drive. All right, T, let's All right, T. Here we go, Mike 20, Mike 20, Mike South Carolina is up by four. Here we go, here we go. Touchdown, South Carolina. This kid is a really reliable weapon. You definitely want the football in his hands near the end zone, and he showed you why right there. He splits the uprights with the extra point. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. You think about the challenges these two teams are facing. On one side, you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead. And on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. Pass! 
He goes out of bounds at the 29-yard line. There's a strike complete. Four yards on that play. You know, little passes like this force the defense to start to come up. Then you can see an offense take their chances downfield later to take advantage of the defense starting to cheat up. Play calling wasn't clicking on that last drive, and their execution was lacking. Fourth down. The punt upcoming, and they're going to come after this one. He really got a hold of that one. Brought down at the 33-yard line. The game packs are just cruising through this first half for me. Really a comfortable lead here. Yep, but still a lot of football left to be played. they got to remember that it's a four-quarter game, and even though that first half went pretty well, things can change in a hurry. It was a pretty one-sided first quarter, but I wouldn't be surprised if things changed in a big way before halftime. Pulls it in, and he's in the open field. Steps out of bounds at the 41. I think it was a great play call, and it was very well executed. Any coach two. would be happy with that kind of outcome on a first or second down play. Second and two coming up here. Ball on their own 41. Quick pass. He's at midfield, and they push him out around the 46-yard line. He is such a reliable target. You throw it anywhere near him, and this guy's going to get his hands on it and make a catch. He's scrambling, decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. And he hits him hard at the 35-yard line. That's good for a From the 35-yard line, first down. Two down, two down. Hey, Mike 20, Mike 20. Green eye, green eye. Gets it out quickly, and he's taken down at the 30. Now, I think he's got a good rhythm going right now with his wide receivers. He hit him for a nice game. Dog four, green 15. Good open field tackle. That makes it first and From the 25 yard line, it's first down. Mike's 40, Mike's 40. Black Easy, easy. Throws complete, and he's hit right away. That brings, that brings him second, second and five. five. Double tight, double tight. Three down, three down. Forty's Mike, Forty's Mike. Is that two? Now he's flushed and they got it. A great defensive end in college football just pins his ears back and has, again, that extra instinct to know when to jump the snap count, green when nine, to take a chance nine. on third down. It seems like they almost save their extra pass rush and extra incentive as far as their, their energy when it really matters on a third down when they feel like they can beat that offensive tackle and get off the line of scrimmage a little bit quicker. And that's something that I think we've seen him do throughout this game. After the sack, it's now fourth and long. It's up, and it's good. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Excellent kick. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on this next drive. He 
Here's an opening. They'll bring him down right around the 34. Oklahoma will take a timeout. That's their first of the half. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. One more play now before we hit halftime, so they'll most likely throw one towards the end zone here. Interception off the deflection. As they head to the locker rooms, this one is far from over. The Gamecocks lead it by two touchdowns. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Chris Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. There's no question you'd rather be up by two scores as opposed to being down by two scores. I mean, David, I totally, That was an easy answer, look, yes. I, I totally <laughs> get that. But I think there is a mindset there that when you have that two-score lead, you're trying to protect something. You don't want to give it up. And if you allow the other team to get close, then, then things can get tied on you. Can a two-score edge sometimes be a little bit dangerous just in terms of mindset? I think mindset and also with coaches. A lot of times you see coaches, they get less aggressive. You know, especially on the defensive side of the football, when you get up two scores and you had so much success blitzing the first half and applying pressure, now you're not as comfortable leaving out guys on an island playing man-to-man -man and giving up big plays. Yeah. So I think you got to make sure that you continue to do what you are doing. Don't make those big mistakes, but also don't stray away from the game plan. Right now, what, it, what you've implemented has worked. Continue to do it. That'll do it here in the studio at halftime. We'll try to see if Pollock can bring a little energy in the second half. Got a lot of games to watch, including yours. Brad and Kurt, ready for the second half. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set for the second half. Sends it sailing downfield. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. The quarterback leads the offense back out onto the field as we get set to resume play. He's taken down at about the 37-yard line. From their own 37-yard line. First down. He's on the run. This is a nice run for the first down by this quarterback. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. Up the middle for a nice game. They're eating up a lot of field on this drive. I'm really impressed with their ball control. Throws it in a hurry. And he's tackled at the 23-yard line. That's a deep number. That brings, that brings up second, second and one. one. From the 23-yard line, it's second down. Three down, three down. Mike's a black ball. And he makes it out to about the 21-yard line. That's good for a gain of two yards. That makes it first and ten. Three down, three down. There you go, Mike 20, Mike 20, Mike 20. Green nine, green. Hey, kill, kill, kill! And a 
quick throw. And they make the stop at about the 17 yard line. That makes it second and six. Here's the eighth play of the series. Black five, black five. Green 15. Motion. He fights forward to about the 16. From the 16-yard line, third down. And he's level at the 27-yard line. He gets it up, and it's long enough, and he splits the uprights. That one looked like cake for this kid. Chalk up three points for the offense. 20-3, to three, South Carolina. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. South Carolina's continuing to play extremely tough defense. This has been impressive. It's just been impressive to watch them play with such an attitude, almost a chip on their shoulder with the energy that they're playing with. And I think it's going to require that kind of effort to be able to win this game. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Nice run, and he's brought down. Around the 39 yard line. Complete. He's got room. He's out of bounds around the 41 yard line. complete. He's got space to work. He steps out around the 44-yard line. It's caught first down, and he's out of bounds. What a relief it is for a quarterback to know that he's got a receiver like this who can step up when he needs him on third down. Throws it to the halfback, and he's got it again. He's pushed out of bounds right around the 32-yard line. So it's second down and about two yards to go. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Caught with room to work. And he is drilled at the 19. by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. And this is the 10th play of the drive. around the 16-yard line. Well, he caught it, but it's almost no yards gained, and now it's fourth down. Give props to the D here for coming up with a big stop on third down. 
It's fourth down, and they're going to try to go for it. Watch out for a pass play when you're in a goal line deep. He's tackled around the 14-yard line. But you can really mess with an offense's game plan if you can take away their ability to run. That brings up second. Play 13 of the current drive. Hey, check, check back 11, check back 11. Dog four, yellow. They'll get him for a loss. One more quarter to play. 20 to three, Gamecock. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. We're still early in the fourth quarter, but that was a huge stop. And now with the lead, they're going to get the football back and an opportunity to stretch the lead. They'll call on the field goal unit here. He gets it up, and it splits the uprights. They line up to kick this one away. And he got all of this one. Great kick. He's to the 20. And he's taken down at the 23. South Carolina is a team on a mission right now, it appears. They have put up 20 points in a row. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. That brings him second and five. From their own 28-yard line, second down. Go ahead, two. Go. That's a great tackle at the 44. Game 16. First down. No chance. 40 Brought down at the 47. Second seven. It's second and seven. Ball on their own 47. You ain't going nowhere. Dog four. And they got him for a loss. That makes it third and seven. And he has it on the corner. He's at the 40. Knocked out of bounds around the 34-yard line. I like the call here by the defense to bring the heat with the outside linebacker. It was just a better call by the offense, and that's why it's a first down. From the 34-yard line, first down. Fires out to his receiver. And a huge touchdown play. He makes the PAT. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He really got a hold of that kick. You know, this offense is doing a pretty good job moving the football. The problem is they're not coming up with touchdowns. The offensive coordinator who's been up here next to us, Brad, in the booth next to us, He's actually just taken off his headsets, and I think he's going down to the field to be next to the quarterback and the rest of this offense to try to engage with them to realize how important it is to finish these drives. Slings it. That's a four on the play. That makes it second and six. Oh, yeah, I'm coming. 
Oh, yeah, I'm coming. Easy, Black five, easy. Black five. Ooh, it was 20. 20. Nine, eight, eight. Caught open field. He gets hit out of bounds at the 34. That's a game of five on the play. Check, 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 check. That'll make it 31. Just under three to go in regulation. Fires out to his wideout. That's a good looking throw and catch. Obviously, the defense is going to have to give them some room, but they're not going to give up the big play. Black five, black Gets it. He's in space, and he hits him hard at the 22-yard line. That's a game of six on the play. Q26, Q26. That brings him second and five. Easy, easy. Four. Just throws this one away. And they'll look to convert here on another third down. Check, check back 11, check back 11. They bring the quarterback down. That's a loss of six yards. That makes it fourth and 12. Check, check Mike 11, check Mike 11. On the ball, on the ball. Here we go, here we go, here we go. He zips it. Throws to the receiver, got it for the touchdown. Nicely designed play to the wide receiver, and it got him six. You said it, Brad, in a good time to call it. I tip my hat to the offensive coordinator. They rolled the dice and went for it on fourth, and I'm sure they're happy with the result. And he converts the extra point. Well, that should pretty much do it for him. Well, at least these guys showed great effort. My hat goes off to these young men for playing so hard out there today. This offense just torched the defense through the air with a great passing attack on their last drive. You know, when this defense went over to the sideline, based on the way they've been playing so far, this defense coordinator has got to be livid. Uh, he's got to get in their face. He's got to challenge them. He's got to get their emotions going. Because when you play defense, it's not just about X's and O's. It's about attitude and playing with a lot of confidence. Just under two to go in the game. And he's taken down around the 33-yard line. From the 33-yard line, it's first down. Sometimes when you've got speed, that's all you need. It's the one thing you just can't defend. You'll get the call again. He makes it out to maybe the 33-yard line. The running back gets a yard, maybe less. Oklahoma's called their final timeout. Here we go, here we go, here we go. They'll bring him down at about the 23-yard line. That's a game of 10 on the play. First down. Two down, two down. Hey, Mike, I know. Dog four, X7. Dog. Run, 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 run. Gains his way to the 10-yard line. Game of 13 on the way. That makes it first Just a minute remains in this football game. And this should be a kneel down as they just try Green to kill nine, the clock. Green nine! Green nine! Go! Takes a knee. The Gamecocks know that they have to enjoy this guy while they've got him because somewhere down the line he's going to be at the next level. Well, that'll definitely be in his future, but for now he needs to sit back and just enjoy this performance. And, and really the play caller, the quarterback, the offensive line, the receivers, the entire group as, as, as just a whole should feel good about their performance. That's it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you soon.